The right vitamins and nutrients are important for our diets. They're obviously important for our animals too. But with the price of minerals going up, some beef producers are having to look for alternatives. Kansas State beef specialist Justin Wagner has some advice. We are expecting to see higher prices for mineral as we get into the fall and even on into the spring booking season of 2022. Uh, most of that's going to be due to kind of the convergence of, of several factors. You know, one of the things we've been talking about in the farming sector is the, the rapid rate at which we've seen our fertilizer input prices go up. Uh, it's many of the same phosphorus sources that would go into those fertilizer products are also utilized to make beef cattle minerals. Some other factors at, at play here, uh, you know, just the, the simple act of moving, you know, commodities uh, across the U.S. in terms of our fuel prices and freight, those are going up as well. Uh, some of the other components that would go into a, to a mineral mix are produced in other countries, and so those are going to be subject to some of the backlogs that we're currently seeing at some of our ports of entry. We know that there's lots of different products out there in terms of the phosphorus levels of minerals, and that's, you know, it used to be historically we'd see a 12% phosphorus mineral that was pretty common. Today we have a variety of products to choose from that would range from 4% phosphorus all the way up to that traditional 12%. Uh, so the first step that I recommend is actually taking into account what we're going to have in terms of our graze forage resources. And so dormant forage um, is going to contain less phosphorus than what we would see during the spring of the growing season. The range we would see in Kansas is somewhere between 0.05% phosphorus all the way up to 0.2 and in some instances 0.3. So it can contribute a fair amount to the diet, especially on a cow that's consuming 25 to 30 pounds of native range um, during the grazing season, depending on whether we're in the fall or we're in the spring.